so peaceful out here. All right, so I took a short little drive and I ended up in a, a state park. It's called Lee State Park in South Carolina. It's very beautiful here. It's moments like these that you gotta literally take in the atmosphere, take in the energy, because right now I feel alive. I feel refreshed. I'm not stressing about work. I'm not stressing about life. I'm not stressing about where I'm gonna live. Nothing. I'm 100% at peace right now. And this state park is actually really helping with my energy. So always take a moment and enjoy the scenery, enjoy the environment, enjoy the people. Do what you can to find happiness in this world. Because me right now, I'm trying to alter my life. I'm trying to think positive, I'm trying to be positive. And it all starts with, with your, your head. So if you fix this, everything else will fall in the line. It could be as simple as, I'm gonna go to work today. I'm gonna do the very best that I can do today. Instead of, ah, crap, I gotta go to work, this sucks. So it's all, it's all a mind game. It's all about how you perceive things. After exploring all day, I cannot believe I found this sweet spot. I'm literally secluded, like down this road is where I came from. And I, I literally bottomed out my car. So no one can be, come back here but me, <laughs> unless you have a, a lifted off-road rig. And the trail goes back a little bit more ways and then it's like a, a turnaround point. Yeah, I'm gonna make a little lunch and enjoy this nice, peaceful day. Birds are chirping, my stomachs are growling. So let's go ahead and make me something to eat. All right, so what we're having today, it's gonna be a quick and easy meal. Got some chili mac. If you've ever been in the military, you know how good these chili macs are. Campbell's, eh, not so much. And also got these little minute white rice kits. Just add water or hot water and it's pretty awesome, so I'm gonna make one of these and then pour a little chili mac on it, mix it all in, have me a decent little meal. Ah. Um, I know y'all haven't seen the new build yet. It's pretty similar to my last 4Runner build, but you get a little sneak peek of this one. My bed's just folded up to a tri-fold mattress, so I just fold it up when I'm trying to cook so I have a working area so I can cook. Uh, this back drawer right here, I just gotta put a, a lid on it, but this is where a lid's gonna be, and I'm gonna cook right on top of this. Let's go ahead and make us some pub. I am no expert chef by no means. But this rice is kind of hard, I'm not gonna lie to you. And I was wrong, these little minute rice cups, they actually don't need water. I only got to heat it up for like a minute because it's hence it's, it's in the title minute rice heat it for a minute so I'm gonna leave it up here for a minute maybe a minute and a half I added some water in here yeah the rice is really jumping Go ahead and turn that off. Stir this in. It's so peaceful out here, guys. Like, you have no idea. I got rice literally everywhere because it kept popping. Be some food for the for the squirrels. All right, so now that I cooled down a little bit. Go ahead and put a little bit back in this cup so I can do this properly without spilling it all. Just about halfway. 
I'm gonna add some chili mac on top. I'm fat, so I need protein. All right, so I dumped a little bit out. Now I'm gonna put the hot rice. I'm gonna grab me a fork. Got myself a little fork, spoon, and knife kit. Some spoon. Go and stir it on in there. Now I'm eating like a true hobo. Pretty good. I mean, it's, it's hard to mess up rice. The can's already cooked. The rice just heats up the can. But yeah, as you can tell, I am living in my vehicle again. Um, actually got out of the military as well. Haven't really told anybody yet. This is just dish soap and water. When I get somewhere I can actually clean it, I'll, I'll do so. But this is pretty sufficient. But yeah. I'm trying to figure out where I want to live next. Because right now I'm just in the process of just traveling and enjoying myself. Who knows where the road is going to take me. Because I honestly have no idea where I want to go. I've been a lot of places on the East Coast, but not, not much on the West Coast besides... California and Oregon and Seattle. So, I've been a few places. I'm thinking about gravitating towards the middle of the United States. That's cooling off, so I'll cleaning up a little bit. I'm gonna finish this and I'm gonna head to the gym. Go to the gym to work out. Take me a nice shower. Yeah. Yes, I did break that tree because sometimes you gotta clear your own way. I didn't film the breaking of the tree part. You can see it's freshly broke.